Hey, good afternoon everyone. Dr. Jamie Trent here. I want to talk about something today that some people might find a little icky to discuss, but it is something that we're finding really can be affecting people's health. And so it's, it's basically parasites. Now a parasite can be anything that lives in or on your body at the expense of your body. So it, yes, it can be. We may be talking about a tapeworm. We may be talking about a liver fluke, but sometimes we're talking about bacteria. Sometimes we're talking about yeast. Candida is the most common one. So a lot of times it's just an imbalance in that gut. But like I said, sometimes that bat or those parasites are able to kind of come up and kind of like I said, just affect your health overall. So it is something that is very common in um, with people that I work with um, and so sometimes we go through and we do parasite cleanses and it can really help improve your health overall but exposure you know where do these come from some of them are on your body at all times it's just when you go through a period of you know being sick uh, being run down stressed out your diet's been bad that you sometimes the imbalance you have the good bacteria and the bad bacteria and sometimes that good bacteria just kind of gets killed off and that bad starts growing up. Now candida is a great example of this. If you're eating a lot of processed food, then it's going to really feed off of that sugar and the process and the chemicals and it's going to kind of come up and it's going to cause your cravings to be worse. It's going to cause skin rashes. It's going to cause a lot of things. But other times we're actually getting that exposure from something. So sometimes we can get it from our food. So if you've ever had food poisoning, you could have been exposed to something there and it could have been in your body for a long period of time. But then as your health maybe slowly started to kind of get worse, that is able to kind of affect your health even more. Could be from the water. I mean, the water we're drinking can have some parasites. Um, if you have animals, animals, any uh, dogs, cats, horses, anything that we're exposed to, we can get exposed to these parasites. And like I said, the reason not everybody is affected by them depends on your health at the time of exposure. So if you're healthy, you have a great digestion, you've got plenty of stomach acid, so as soon as that maybe goes in through your mouth, as soon as it gets into the stomach, that stomach acid just destroys them all and there's no problems, okay? But say you go through a period of stress. Stress has a tendency to really decrease the stomach acid in our stomach and we're not going to produce as much. So if you're you know, getting exposure, so say you go out to eat, you get exposed to something and you've had a really, really stressful week, now that parasite's able to kind of take hold and start causing problems. So it's not as yucky as a you know topic as a lot of people think it is, but it is something that, like I said, you really may want to address. Symptoms can be everything. I mean, it can be bowel issues, it can be bloating, it can be constipation, diarrhea, skin rashes, headaches, foggy headedness, fatigue. I mean, it goes on and on. So I mean, it can be a little bit of everything. One thing that you might pay attention to is if you notice, um, and sleep issues too, but if you notice like around the full moon that your all of your symptoms have a tendency to get a lot worse, that is a pretty good indication that a parasite may be affecting your health because they found that these bugs like to kind of wake up and feed a little bit more around the full moon. So that would be a good indication. So if you notice you don't sleep very well around the full moon, you get more bloated, your digestion's off, your hormones are a little bit worse, anything, that might be an indication you need to kind of take a look at your gut and help balance and maybe do a little bit of a parasite purge. So um, we're kind of, I've been kind of using different companies over the years to kind of help people do uh, kind of balance their bodies and kind of purge these parasites. Um, we have the last year or so started using a newer company called Cellcore. Um, they are really a very unique company. They have something called carbon technology to where they actually bind their supplements to carbon and it allows it to be absorbed into our bodies and actually gets into our cells. So not only does this do a gut cleanse or purge, it, this also does a cellular detox. So it's amazing the results we are starting to get with these products. So just wanted to kind of point out two, two, uh, two of their supplements. Um, the two that really, one that makes them very unique, this is kind of, they were kind of the first ones to really use this one. It's called Mimosa Pudica. I always have to read it because I can never remember, but it's in there called Parawan. So this is one, this was a game changer for this company and this, is the, this was their very first product. So what this is, is it actually is very, very sticky. And what it does is it helps bind to all those toxins and chemicals and parasites and different things in the gut to help eliminate them. So the Para One alone is just one thing that really has just helped increase our uh, 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 results, there we go, with our parasite cleanses. The other one is their amazing biotoxin binder. I absolutely love this. This is a combination of 
It's got your humic acid, which is going to be their fulvic acid. Um, that's kind of their carbon technology. The broccoli sprout extract, yucca fruit fulvic acid, which is the other uh, carbon technology, and citric acid. And I've already looked into all their ingredients. Their citric acid is not does not come from mold. They actually get it grown from a bacteria and it's very, very clean. So there's no contraindications or anything with people with mold toxicity. So, um, so this is a great one. I have been using this one a lot with all, it, just any of my patients who just feel like they need to detox. This is a great one to take if you've been exposed to, you know, if you had food poisoning, you know you ate something that maybe had something in it, or if you've just been exposed to a virus or something, taking this will help bind it in the gut and kind of help eliminate it from the body. So, okay, so that's just kind of some quick information on parasites. Like I said, it's just another area of health that we really need to kind of address at times. And like I said, not everybody needs to do that. Um, most, a lot of people don't have any issues with that but a lot of people do. So like I said, if your health is just continuing to deteriorate, you're not sure what's going on, you just can't figure out what you need to do, you're eating a healthy diet, you're exercising, and just nothing's really improving, you might wanna reach out to me, let's get together, let's talk and see if we can kind of find what your body needs. So, okay guys, have a great rest of your day.